What if I say that you can create all component files immediately in your React or Vue.js project? Here is the list of the three unique VS Code extensions to save hours of your web developer life. The first and most brilliant extension is the folder templates. It's quite a usual situation for every web developer when you need to create a new component like button or input for your React project. Most developers are used to doing it manually. The typical flow in React looks like creating a new component folder inside components and sequentially adding styles, component and constant file, and maybe index to React. After that, you might want to add all imports, exports and other required stuff inside your files. Folder templates allows you to create a component folder and all the required files immediately with all necessary presets inside. To flexibly set up the extension, you should install it and after that open the VS Code preferences. Here you need to add the folder templates.structures property and declare the required file structure as an array. You are able to describe any file structure you want to get. You just need to fill in the file name property in the structure array. Variable ft name inside angle brackets will be replaced with the component name during execution. You can also prescribe all imports, exports, TypeScript models, so whatever you want in every template based on the template name. Using the folder templates.file templates property. For example, here I declare an index file to re export my component from an original one. A little above, I describe a default functional component structure. Now you can save it and simply create a new component much faster. All settings you will find on the video description. The second extension here is CSS variable autocomplete. I hope each of you uses CSS variables today. Normally we need to wrap every CSS variable to a var and round brackets. Looks simple, but even here we can do it a little easier and faster with the CSS variable autocomplete extension. Just install it, and after that, you can start writing CSS variable name to be used, press tab, and it will be automatically wrapped to var and round brackets. Perfect. The last extension here is console ninja. If you're a huge console log fan like me and are used to using it to display your data, you will probably like this simple extension. Console Ninja immediately displays console log output directly in your editor, so you can avoid switching between browser and code editor and save a lot of time. Subscribe for more tips and tricks.